Good morning everyone, today is another pre-maintenance checklist video which means I'm going to be going over all the current events which are going away with the coming maintenance. But before we jump into all of that, if you're new to the channel, I upload NGS content daily, so if you do play this game, I would really appreciate to subscribe as it really helps out the channel. Anyway, without further ado, let's begin the video. Alright, so the first most obvious one is going to be the New Year's 2023 Seasonal Point event. So if we look at our event lady over here, and if we go to exchange seasonal points over here, you'll notice there's a little bracket saying until January 18th. Now maintenance is January 11th. However, after January 11th, you will no longer be able to earn seasonal points. You can still spend the seasonal points at the seasonal shop until the 18th, but you won't be able to earn any more. So as I said in my previous videos before, if you wanted to buy all of the minerals, you are looking at 5 million seasonal points. However, the bare minimum that I would recommend most people is to at the very least buy out all the Infernium, which only costs 400,000 seasonal points. Under normal circumstances, even in an unorganized group, that will take you about 4 hours of PSE bursting. However, if you're not very fond of PSE farming, you could also do the practice drill snow field workup. Now, I do recommend doing rank 5 and I do recommend doing this at least once because you do get 10 special scratch tickets. Now, a lot of people might be undervaluing these special scratch tickets. As you can see here, I've got 464 of these special scratch tickets and some people might be like, Carol, why on earth do you have so many scratch tickets? And the reason for this is because I'm currently waiting for the special scratch to add new items or do a full rehaul before I spend all of my special scratch tickets. And the nice thing about these special scratch tickets is there is the SG plus 100 ticket. Now, it does have a low percentage, you know, it's only a 1% chance. However, there are plenty of opportunities to get the 10 SG as well as the 20 SG. And on top of that, after scratching 40 times, you actually do get a special selector ticket, which will allow you to pick anything from this prize list. So I do recommend people not to sleep on these special scratch tickets because essentially these are star gems just sitting in your inventory. The next thing I want to talk about are the keywords. Again, I will leave all the keywords in the description below. However, there is one that is going away pretty soon, and that is the Sonic underscore frontiers underscore on underscore sale underscore now. So by typing this keyword, you get a floating Sonic, a floating Tails, a floating Knuckles, as well as five special scratch tickets. So make sure if you have not used this keyword yet that you type it ASAP because this will be going away on January 10th. Another thing that is going away is going to be the pre-announced urgent quest with the double augment capsule drops. So uh, you want to take advantage of that, especially with the Dust Soul capsules, by the way. The Dust Soul 4 capsules have increased significantly in price as people People have realized that, uh, you know, Dust Soul 4 is actually really, really good. Now, another thing that is going away is the Enhancement Success Rate Boost of 40%, as well as the Augmentation Success Rate plus 5%, and of course, the Special Scratch Tickets, where you get 5 Special Scratch Tickets every single day for just logging on. All of this will be going away after the coming maintenance. Another thing that will be going away are the music discs as well as the stamp and emote set from the AC shop. So remember all these fancy stamps I wanted a long time ago was going to be your last chance to pick any of these up from the AC shop. If you don't get them now, then unfortunately you will be at the mercy of other players through the player shop. Next up is the AC points purchase boost. So this is the thing where Sega will match the amount that you top up. So Sega will pick 200 winners and based on how much AC they topped up, they will match it by 10%, 30%, 50%, and 100%. So if you are planning to top up now is probably a good time because don't forget you can double dip with the ARCS Cash Super Sale that's going on right now. Now the ARCS Cash Super Sale does not end until February 8th. So you have plenty of time if you want to hold off in case there's just nothing that you want right now. So please don't feel pressured to spend any money. And last but not least are the AC scratches. There are a lot of AC scratches which are going away. So as we can see, the Remix line is going away, the Reminiscent Collection 3, the Rewind Collection 8, the New Year's Memories, as well as the Crystalline Concepts. All of these scratches will be going away with the coming maintenance. So if you want anything from these scratches, please make sure to pick them up before they go away. Now with all of that out of the way, what should you be looking forward towards next week? Well, the first thing is we are going to be getting a new ARCS record challenge. So as we can see here, upcoming events, this begins in two days and 18 hours we will have the ordinal tower rank 7 solo version as well as party version i believe sega has finally fixed all the bugs so hopefully when we do the ordinal tower this time all of our scores are going to be saved however the big thing is going to be the winter seasonal event because in that seasonal shop we are going to be able to pick up mastery 4 capsules as well as gigastat 4 capsules so that is going to be the main attraction so a lot of people are going to be incentivized to do a ton of grinding starting from next week 
Special thanks to all the members for supporting the channel. It really means a lot to me. Thank you again. But yeah, that's all I wanted to cover in today's video. Hopefully you guys found it helpful. If you did, I would appreciate a like and a subscribe. And I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye. What can I say except you're welcome?